Hey guys and welcome back to the mom look. In this video I'm going to be walking you through my mom proof foundation routine. So let's get started. All right, step one, do a little shimmy, get the blood flowing. There are a few tools you're gonna need. First off, you're gonna need a beauty blender. And then a handful of brushes. This handful of brushes really just needs to contain a buffing brush for your foundation, a highlighting brush, a powder brush, and a contour brush. You're gonna want your face to be nice and clean and moisturized. Then you take your favorite primer, make a little blob on your finger, rub it in, pat it on your face, smush your face all around, and then you're primed. Next you take whichever foundation you like the best. I use two pumps, the Giorgio Armani Luminous Silk Foundation, then I dot it all over my face. Once you're nice and polka dotted, it's time to blend. And voila, your face is a scary dimensionless canvas. So next comes concealer. I use Born This Way by Too Faced in shade light. So I just dab that on my face in the areas that I feel like I have darker circles, redness, or areas in my face that I just want to highlight. And then I blend. Next I use a cream highlight. This is LA Lights by Smashbox. This is absolutely not a necessary step. I just like my glow. So I rub that on the back of my hand and then I take it on my fingers and pat it on the areas I highlight. Then I use the same method with a cream blush. Next I use this poof from LH Cosmetics to apply the Charlotte Tilsbury Airbrush Flawless Finish Micro perfecting powder in fair aka the biggest mouthful of a makeup name ever and i just apply this under my eyes to set my concealer and to my problem areas where i would have a little bit of oiliness or possible creasing in my foundation Next, I dip into my LH Cosmetics Infinity Palette for my contouring and bronzing. I use Cigar and Zwicky.
Next, you take a big fluffy powder brush and your favorite blush. And you make a little smile and apply the blush to the apples of your cheeks and wherever else you feel like putting it that day. And now. Finally, the most important step is probably this setting spray. I'm using NYX Dewy Finish. I spritz it all over my face and then I fan it down a little bit to dry it out. <laughs> yep, then I use my Beauty Blender one last time just to pounce it all in. And this really makes the whole look come together, makes it not cakey and it makes it last forever. All right guys, here's the final look. I added some brows, mascara, and a little bit of eye makeup. This foundation routine has been working absolute wonders for me. It's been kiss proof, slobber proof, and little finger proof for the 12 plus hours that I wear it a day. So I hope you guys give it a try. Let me know what you think in the comments below and I'll see you guys next week.